The city of Frisco mourning the death of a 10th grader who died after being hit while riding his bike to football practice before the first day of school. Fox Wars' Paige Ellenberger is live with how the community is remembering him. Paige. Yeah, good morning. 15-year-old Landon Bork was riding his bike yesterday morning, trying to cross at an intersection near Roach Middle School when a driver hit and killed him. Now that section where the accident happened is on Independence Parkway and some nearby homeowners say it's a magnet for speedy drivers. Bork was crossing the road on George Washington Drive when he was hit. Police have yet to say who was at fault or if speed was a factor. Witnesses couldn't believe what had happened on Wednesday morning and the teen's classmates are now trying to come to terms with their friend's death. It was really shaken up to see, you know, kind of what happened and, um, you know, kind of one of the first folks on scene. He waited for the officers to arrive and um, somebody was giving CPR to the young man on the um, on the street, but apparently he didn't he didn't make it, which was very sad. I didn't think it was him at first. I thought it was just someone else. And it was just didn't feel real. A GoFundMe was created to help the Bork family. Its original goal was set at 15,000, but so far it's exceeded that. It now sits at over 40,000. Now police have released little details about what exactly happened leading up to the crash. We do know that the driver stopped to render aid. However, it's unclear as of right now if they'll face any charges. I did talk with McKinney police just a few moments ago who say that this incident will take a few weeks to investigate. Live in Frisco, I'm Paige Ellenberger for Good Day.